Mother of Parliaments, which has withstood a number of sieges in its long life, comes near to succumbing when the River Thames threatens to break its banks. When he's in an aggressive mood, the old river is no respecter of persons or property. A surge from the North Sea, a combination of high spring tides and gale force winds, forces a wall of water up the river's narrow reaches. No more than 19 inches separate central London from catastrophe. An overspill could have flooded 46 square miles of the capital's commercial and business areas, a disaster measured in tens of millions of pounds. Flood barriers hold, but there's danger in the Thames' upper reaches at Chiswick, Richmond and Twickenham. Meanwhile, suburban riverbank dwellers can only keep watch on flood levels and hope for the best. The city fathers are aware of the threat to the capital. Lower down the river, in London's old dockland area, a multi-million pound barrier is under construction, but that won't be ready until 1982. Between now and then, Londoners pray Old Father Thames will keep rolling along within limits. Exactly a hundred years after Alexander Graham Bell showed his new telephone...